So here's the next Playmate one that I'm doing. Um, I already got pretty far along in the process before making a video, but so be it. Uh, here's the main body. This one's going to be a little bit more elaborately done, uh, professionally done, if you will. Um, I have already bondoed all the seams um, there, filled in everything with the filler, made all the cuts, filled in anything that should be filled in up on the top here as well, um, and uh, on the inside as well too, along here. And there, the edges, right up here, it's all filled in and ready to be primed. I've also sanded down the whole um, body um, just to be able to accept the primer a little bit better. And um, that's, that's the next step, really. Also, uh, I also bondoed the back door. This will obviously be the your access area in the back. Um, but I've gone ahead and filled in all this nice and flat. Once it's primed and painted, you won't see any of this. Um, all that's been filled in up here as well. Um, and I actually added a whole bunch of filler up here because, unfortunately, when this particular uh, toy was made, um, even before I made the cuts and everything for the door, uh, off the battery door and everything, um, when you put the battery door in, it never actually... Uh, lined up perfectly with this part of the back of the of the, the tricorder. Um, it was always a little further down. Matter of fact, you can kind of see it um, still. I mean, right there is where the door is. Meanwhile, the body is more up here. So I had to fill in the rest of that, this back door here with the uh, filler um, so that it is perfectly straight now. And obviously once you prime it and paint it, it'll just look like one piece. And that's where I stand on this one. Everything in the inside obviously has been cut out. Um, all cuts have been made. This thing is pretty much ready for priming, which I'm about to do in a few minutes. So next video will be, once it's dried, I'll show you it primed. Alright, see you guys soon.